Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Kogulas Nation. My name is Secret Agent Nixon of Kogulas. I'm the founder and the director of the Kogulas Industry Spy Network and the Kogulas Nation. What you see on screen is not I3WM, though, granted, I'll still use I3. Instead, what you see is something called BSPWM. BSP is shorthand for binary space partitioning, a mathematical algorithm that splits 3D objects into smaller, more manageable objects. Now, it's quite common to use BSP in computer graphics and computer graphics rendering. But we don't have any of that in this window manager. So let's get this installed. First things first, you need to do sudo apt update. Nothing special there. Always update before you do this type of stuff. That way, if you hadn't done a backup yet, you'll be able to have a backup for if things get messed up. Next, you need to do sudo apt install bspwm and sxhkd. You need to install these two items. There are going to be some dependencies. One of them will be lemon bar. I don't use lemon bar, so you can go ahead and get rid of it if you want, or you can keep it. But I won't be using it since I already have polybar up there. It's actually pretty easy to get set up. After that is done, we need to do a quick make dir. We need to make two directories, both of which are going to be in the home directory and then dot config. We'll do bspwm. We'll need to do the same thing, but for sxhkd. I will actually demonstrate this now. There we go. So now, once these directories are made, we'll need to copy the default configurations. So for that, we'll need to cp into user share doc. We'll go ahead and do bspwm and examples. I will copy this entire thing and do the same thing here. On the left hand side, let's do sxhkd and then bring that, the sxhkd rc specifically, into dot config and sxhkd. And then over here, we'll go ahead and use the bspwmrc and then bring that into dot config and bspwm. Once this is done, you'll be able to configure those. But BSPWM will not be usable yet. This is a very common gotcha, and I even suffered from this gotcha, because we need to make these executable, both the SXHKDRC and the BSPWMRC. You just need to do chmod plus x, and then go into your dot configs, BSPWM, and its RC. I'll just tap complete that. We'll do the same thing here, chmod plus x, and then home directory, dot config, sxhkd, and then it's rc. Once these two are made into executable binaries, bspwm will work. That's actually pretty simple to do. Mind you, this is for Ubuntu and Debian based distributions of which I am using an Ubuntu base in Linux Mint 21.3. Now, yes, you can install window managers on Mint, and usually Mint doesn't have a problem with it, specifically i3, AWM, and BSPWM. I've used a couple of others, but I hadn't really dug my claws in except for i3 and BSP. So once that's done, we'll go ahead and do two windows. I'll do two windows myself. Now, obviously we are in the monocle layout, but I can go ahead and do the tiled layout. I have BSP layout, which is a plugin that allows me to do shenanigans like this. I will go ahead and set this to use NeoVim, but you can use Nano, Micro, whatever text editor you like. We'll go into .config, sxhkd, and it's RC. Booyah. That's the SXHKDRC. This is where you place in the key bindings in order to control BSPWM. Now, we'll do the same thing over here. Again, I'll use NeoVim. of 
Ooyan. Now, this is kind of weird, but the split ratio is a bit strange. I'll set it to the default, which is 0.52. Reset the window manager. Reset this. And it's not going to do anything yet. That's fine. I can do the window gap of 10. Hmm. Yeah, something weird's going on. I'll have to figure that out shortly. But anyway, we have here the BSPC monitor. Pretty much I know all of these, so I can go ahead and just do this. Now, these probably do have to match with the BSP whatever. So I'll just go ahead, take care of all of these, because I kind of know how these work. And there we go. Write it. And reset it. There we go. That should be fine. And actually, it was done using Roman numerals, so I think I should be okay. This, however, is where we actually do all of the things for BSPWM. All of them. And down here, I have a couple of things. I don't have any way to lock the screen. I tried using better lock screen, but it doesn't work for me. So I need to find a better lock screen than better lock screen. So we have here BSP layout. This is actually what I used in order to bring up the master and stack layout. Nothing special, but I also have master and stack wide layout or monad wide, which I believe comes from X monad. We have grid, even and tiled. That's Rofi. We obviously have the monocle layout, which is going to be the default in BSPWM. So keep that in mind. If you decide to use BSPWM, you are probably going to want to grab BSP layout, which is actually a GitHub repository that will be linked below, as well as some other things. This will also include my dot files where you can find the SXHKDRC and the BSPWMRC. But I am afraid that is going to be it for this video. Thank you, and good night.